1963, construction began on one of the largest engineering projects in U.S. history. The population in Southern California had exploded in the early 1900s, and the desert atmosphere was less than hospitable, especially in Los Angeles, where there was absolutely no indication that population growth would do anything but accelerate. It was a formidable problem, one without a conceivable solution. But by the 1920s, William Mulholland, let's call him the problem solver, had already begun brokering an aqueduct deal that would build a dam on the Colorado River and supply some of LA's water from the east. That took care of some of the need, but the Angelinos needed more. Eventually, the California Aqueduct Project was birthed. It was a plan to bring water from the Sacramento River Basin in Northern California and channel it for over 440 miles to the south. This led to the water wars, devastating floods, and many problems, including a major breach in the south just days after the water began to flow. But the visionaries continued, undaunted, and here we are today. Over 20 million people depend on the water from this California aqueduct. Here's my takeaway as an Angelino, born and raised. There is still animosity here in California about stealing the water from the north. However, this does not distract from the reality that this was one audacious project and one huge problem solved. Here's the point. Someone needed to step up. Someone needed to solve the problem. Someone needed to look past the failures and continue on for the sake of the future. I don't know what big, audacious, scary problem you are currently facing as a leader, but you need to ask yourself this one question. Am I going to give it my all to make it happen or am I going to cower at the enormity of everything? Let me challenge you. Envision the future. Identify the risks. Anticipate the distractions. Solve the problems and take your first step. As the leader, it's up to you.